The biggest shock of the night, Workington. Labour for more than 100 years is now Conservative. Kicked out, Sue Heyman. But I've been very proud to represent this constituency for the last four years. And I'm very proud to have been the first woman Member of Parliament elected in Cumbria. In her place, Mark Jenkinson. Working men and women came out to tell us that they want to get Brexit done. And we're going to do that. I'll just I'll work tirelessly every every second of every day to ensure that this constituency is in a better position when I leave it than, than tonight. In the seat vacated by Rory Stewart, the voters elected Neil Hudson for the Tories. Conservatives also held on to Copeland. No surprises in Carlisle given the national picture. John Stevenson increases his majority. Carlisle's a changing city. Carlisle wants to get Brexit done, but has also rejected socialism and I think it embraces one nation conservatism. And now in January, with the majority he has got, quite clearly I think we will get Brexit done and then we can move on and start dealing with the other issues that matter both to Carlisle and to our country. Former Lib Dem leader Tim Farron more than doubles his majority in Westmoreland and Lonsdale. That seat is the only one declared within the ITV border region that isn't Conservative. Until now, Labour was holding on in Cumbria by its fingertips. This morning, the Workington man has wiped them out.